And now let's get into WWE WrestleMania 37 Night 1. Whoops, it's WrestleMania Saturday. At some point, they stopped calling it Night 1, and they called it Saturday. I think from now on, every show is called WrestleMania. We have WrestleMania Saturday, and then WrestleMania Sunday. Vince now we have WrestleMania Backlash. Day and nights. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> day and nights don't exist. So this is, they have a crowd here. There's a, a crowd mm -hmm. here, and they showed them many times. Uh... <laughs> Despite his pride. Yeah, sort of Jimmy Lloyd was there. Them. Jimmy Lloyd. Oh, did you <laughs> see the greatest what happened? Thing ever. Yes. Jimmy oh. Lloyd's in the crowd wearing a GCW shirt, and then they make him change it into a Hurt Business shirt. <laughs> and then he wrestles later the night in the Hurt Business shirt. <laughs> that, is that is so, so good. They so actually do good. that. I saw people like not believing that that happened, but they yeah, definitely no. do that. It Tony, you remember to you? When that? Yeah, Tony, <laughs> you were there for that, weren't you? At oh, the SummerSlam? Cool. Yeah, yeah, and you had to change had your to shirt. Had to change shirts because I was in a Bobby Roode shirt. Damn. Yeah, I remember so, that, dude. Did you yeah. have to pay for it? No, no. They reimbursed. Well, I had to pay for it, and then they reimbursed me for it. Because um, I think he had to pay half of it. Oh. Okay. I think it was half That's price worse. for Jimmy Lloyd. <laughs> 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 That's the worst. But Jimmy Lloyd is an official member of the Hurt Business. <laughs> uh, yeah, so fans are here, yes. uh, but the show is not starting. And people are like, what the hell is going on here? There was a lot of rumors going on before the show, too, that big old thunderstorms were coming in. And there was people in the arena. So the show started like eight. I think around mm -hmm. five uh, people were like already in the arena, you know, just filing in. But then they yeah. had to they were evacuated because uh, there was a storm coming. And usually so it's it's not so much the rain. They don't give a fuck if you get wet. It's the lightning. The lightning is what yeah, they're lightning's about. crazy. Yeah. But honestly, they should just let it go because everyone had to sign the WrestleMania waiver and it said, <laughs> if you show up to the show, you die. So whatever. <laughs> There's a small print down there. Is, yeah. it, also, if you die due to anything else, that's also not a problem. Well, how crazy would that have been? They have signed this COVID waiver and you die from lightning. Holy fuck. <laughs> COVID <shit>. lightning. <laughs> yeah. It's the perfect storm. Yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, they evacuated. Uh, people had to stay outside until the rain died down, which was like probably an hour later. Supposedly, Virgil was <laughs> was there trying to get fans to pay for pictures of them. Was, That's what's up, dude. Five dollar I mean, checkies pay. with Virgil. I think it was ten. <laughs> Even better, one thousand yen checkies with Virgil. <laughs> but eventually, uh, around showtime, I'd say about. Uh, I mean, obviously, the people are in the arena once the show starts. Uh, the pre-show is going on. There's people in the arena. The pre-show started at seven, which I was weird. I f don't. I, I unless I'm crazy, haven't pay-per-views been starting at seven? Like the actual pay-per-view starts at seven? Yes. For like a while now. Yes. Why is it eight now? Yeah, I'm not sure. I was confused too. I thought someone was trolling me when they said it's already. It eight. threw me off. Yeah. Yeah. But no. Yeah, this one started at eight, and honestly. It's probably for the better because if it started at seven, there's no way the show would have went on for like. Oh my god! An I mean, for now. us, it would have been oh, fantastic. <laughs> yeah, that's true. But for them, it would have sucked. Well, unless um, I started my stream at seven and then I'd sit there for two hours while nothing happens. That you didn't watch awesome. the pre-show. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> you can't make me. Dude, speaking of the pre-show, so the pre-show starts within the first five minutes. There's a CM Punk chant. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, that's the first chant back. <laughs> I was like, yeah, that's awesome. Oh, my favorite that's... part too was the first pop back was for Vince McMahon. He said, "I'm gonna get that." What real a quick. what a fucker! Yeah. <laughs> I'm what a scumbag! <laughs> my creation, <laughs> man! <yeah. laughs> Bro, they got NFTs now. <laughs> I couldn't fucking believe the, what I saw. Dude, you uh, can own when are we gonna, the um, Shit, when are we going to talk about that? Should we just talk about that now? What, you want to get the NFTs? Like NFTs? I want to talk about it. I just want to talk about what they are, because I don't know if people know that this yeah. is even happening. All right, who wants um, to get the Rock Fleshlight NFT? <laughs> <laughs> You can own deadlock moments. Yeah, like that's when James, actually really good. When, when James purposely spit all over his computer. <laughs> <laughs> James had a stroke NFT. <laughs> so, WWE is in the NFT business. Now, if you don't know what an NFT is, don't Undertaker's worry. in the NFT business. <laughs> of course he is. Yes, of course he is. He's on the polls. He's got the Bitcoin Undertaker, Undertaker coin. Of course, uh, if you don't know what a uh, NFT is, don't worry. No one, no one does. I no one doesn't either. <laughs> no. I can explain it. I guess. Sure. You kinda... Go on. So yeah. it's like it's buying some, like buying a JPEG, and you own the JPEG. You own, yeah, you own a thing, gift or a right? gift. Like, yeah, yeah it's like, it like I know what a JPEG is. <laughs> <laughs> so you, there's no way to display it right now. Like you just have it. So like I don't know what you're gonna do. If, with maybe it, if you get but... a digital frame. Me and the boys are gonna <laughs> NFT. <laughs> I'm going to NFT UK. That's a show we don't want. <laughs> 
So there is six Undertaker NXTs. <laughs> there is. <laughs> Undertaker there is, NXTs and nobody's is, fucking watching them. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck! Uh, making more than the whole roster with this one site. <laughs> Undertaker NXTs. So there's That's an Undertaker awesome. Bronze Modern, which was a hundred dollars, uh, and it's a it's a moving picture of the Undertaker and his pictures behind it with lightning. Yeah. And then there's the Undertaker Bronze Retro, which is similar, uh, $100 as well. Then there's Undertaker Silver for $1,000, which is him uh, very similar to the That's Awesome pose. <laughs> Just, <laughs> Undertaker <laughs> NFT of his cameo. <laughs> I would buy that in a heartbeat. <laughs> Scooby yeah. That's Awesome. <laughs> then there's, uh, um, there's two of those for 1000 Then there's Undertaker Gold, which is, uh, that auction ended at, let me see, I believe it was... Thirty thousand uh, dollars, which wow. is a video, a fifteen-second video clip of that entrance where all the zombies were reaching their hands up during his entrance. Was that twenty-nine? Uh, no. yeah, the Triple H one, I think. Yeah, one of it's close to that. Yeah, so that, and then the big one, uh, Undertaker Platinum, one hundred thousand dollars. It ended at, uh, huh. and that one is mankind getting thrown off the Hell in a Cell. Oh, um, okay. So, how much do you think this is gonna be worth in like? Six years. What do you think? I don't think it's worth anything now. <laughs> it's worth It'll at least a hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Guess so. It'll be worth I, a million. It'll be I a million dollar item. I'm. I'm. And maybe I'll be wrong. I don't understand it at all. Uh, like uh, uh, apparently the the NFT game is blowing up in a couple of years. They're gonna have ways ways to display it, and it's supposed to be a big deal. But I don't. Yeah. Know. So like, I think it's stupid. I don't. I don't want to do it. I would wouldn't want anyone to ever do it. After this show, you guys head over to deadlockpw.com <laughs> forward slash NFT <laughs> to get your silver, bronze, and platinum deadlock NFT. <laughs> Tony or, being crucified or, by the other yeah. NFT. Clyde Frog NFT. To, uh, yeah. It's on the symbol. <laughs> <laughs> or nxt.deadlock.com if you want to check yeah, it out. Yeah, you can find it there as well. So yeah, I don't I don't know, man. I mean, they have the video of the Undertaker Mankind thing on here. I can just download it. It's mine now. So I don't know. <laughs> give me, no, give you me. Get a, it's dude, free. This is minted and it has a mm. authentication with it and you are the only one that actually owns it. So you could probably, I don't know, do you yeah, own rights to it? Yeah, but I pay for it? Peacock and it's on Peacock. I can watch this whenever I want. But you don't own is the it, moment. Which mo Wait, is it when he gets thrown off the cell or through the cell? Off, off the cell. The who the fuck cares about that? Going through the cell is what the good one. <laughs> that, I mean, that should be a hundred thousand dollar one. He gets fucked in the face by the chair, <laughs> and what even what's even more valuable than that is Terry Funk getting choke slammed out of his shoes. <laughs> <laughs> That's ultra which platinum, even, <laughs> which is even better. <laughs> My shoes, Tanker. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, WrestleMania happened. Uh, yeah, WrestleMania thirty-seven. So as you said, Vince opened the show. The entire roster behind him. Uh, Randy Orton and Edge were standing next to each other, so fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> Big friends. I really want. I was like, damn, this set looks so cool. All the rosters on the stage. I want them to just do like a battle royal, like up on this stage right now. Be yeah, sweet. my man Otis was out there in gear. I said, do you even matter? Dude, he, <laughs> dude, he was gyrating. <laughs> he you was see Otis gyrating? Yeah, dude, he was gyrating. So, it was crazy. Vince says, Vince welcomes you to WrestleMania. Come on. And then underneath all your seats is a lethal jet. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> a vaccine. <laughs> hey, congrats. No, no. <laughs> Free vaccinations with your NFTs. Dude, uh, speaking of the WrestleMania set, did you see the pirate ship banner that was ripped at the top? They, yeah, it got blown they, off. <laughs> they had, there was a dude who had to climb up on that pole to try and fix those banners. There was oh like my all God. of him During climbing the storm. up. Yeah, like Damn. up there with lightning going, he's trying to fix these banners. You get your ass up there right now. Oh, dude, <laughs> speaking of lightning, it was funny because Bobby Lashley's thing is just lightning. His entrance starts with lightning. <laughs> yeah, couldn't have played it any more perfect. Is this, um? so they, they do that. Is the show open new? Is that new with the, the King of Kings shit? Is that, all, like, is that new? What, the WWE Forever thing? Yeah, um, I don't know actually. I know they. It's been like doing an update. I think it's like an updated version of it, what it was. Yeah. Like they had like Triple H, King of Kings, like Cena saying Champ is here or something like that or something like. That. I was like, yeah, oh, it was. Weird. It's just like a little updated. It's like yeah. similar to what they had before. But yeah, I know updated. they had WWE Forever, but I don't know about the rest of it. So and then we get uh, BB Rexa. Hello. Hi, hey, baby. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> True. Hey, uh, she does, uh, what is it, America the Beautiful? Uh, uh, yes. Yeah. 
hate America. Yeah, I so, thought she was uh, going to do the crack addict song, but I guess not. Yeah. <laughs> Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be awesome. <laughs> stand up for the national anthem. No, crack at it. They made the roster stand on the stage during this, uh, and Otis is dancing. <laughs> That's my Everyone's dude. Trying to be real serious, and Otis, Otis is there gyrating Otis his is hips, just going. Otis doing the grind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the piece. table grind. He was getting. Then it. they do this long fucking cold open, which I didn't hate. It was just felt like it went on forever. They do it again on the second night. Yeah. It's awesome. I didn't realize, like, at first I was like, okay, and then they were like, complete with epic epicness, bigger than history, yeah. than history, and then they're just like, oh, is that the best voiceover? I'm like, oh my god. This is a joke. <laughs> they did it last year, too. <laughs> like, just stop with that, yeah. man. Also, I'm pretty sure, uh, so they, eventually they, they cut to the commentators for, I'm like, okay, that's weird. Usually I figured, like, here comes an entrance right after the open, uh, but it cuts to the commentators and staring at the commentators. They're talking, they're still talking, and then someone in the background you hear talking over the house mic, oh, like while they're talking. I was like, "This is <laughs> fucking weird." There's a lot of weird technical problems going on at the beginning of the first night. Yeah, and they're they're talking, and then they're like, "There's there uh, like there was a bunch of people behind them." And then they cut away, and then they cut back, and there's no one behind them. There's a weather delay at start WrestleMania. Holy shit! Uh, this is unbelievable. Yeah, this is I've the never first seen time it's ever like happened. That. Yeah, which is I guess. Impressive that they've never had a weather issue like that before. Yeah, but, it's actually uh, fucking insane that they've never yeah. had a, a, a weather issue ever. Yeah, uh, we, and I'll give it to them. I liked what they did with it. They just said, "All right, go out there and send everyone to do interviews and just talk, just talk, just fucking say." Yeah, some Kevin, stuff. we know your match is tomorrow, but just go ahead and talk now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, and there was a big scroller. Uh, at the bottom it says WrestleMania is in a weather delay. This event will resume when weather permits. So this is like I don't know how long did this go on for? Like a half hour? Yeah, it was at least 30, 40 minutes. Yeah, yeah. it was. Felt like a while. Uh, they had Shane do an interview. MVP and Lashley did it. Drew interrupted him. JBL mentioned the booty, booty god. <laughs> 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 I don't know why he did. He just did. <laughs> that was cool. And they popped the boys. Uh, New Day did an interview. Uh, all these were cool. Kevin Owens did one. His mic fucked up during it, though. Probably got hit by lightning. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> yeah, what the hell, dude? <laughs> Kevin was like, yeah, me and Sammy were doing this. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Someone just died. <laughs> it's probably the dude trying to change the fucking mast on the boat. Yeah, he's standing on a big <laughs> electric <was> pole. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. BB Rexa just got annihilated. <laughs> oh, just still dancing. <laughs> <laughs> then... They cut to a shot of Michael Cole and Samoa Joe in ponchos. Yeah, that was awesome. This was the greatest <laughs> thing ever. Standing in the rain, Samoa Poncho Joe is awesome. They were just <laughs> saying, hey, we're, it's, it's fucked here. You can see the canopy behind them dripping and just pouring. With rain. I knew people were slipping tonight. I just knew it. Hell yeah. We get a Bianca promo. We get a Seth promo, Miz and Morrison promo. And then finally, they uh, are bringing on people in and we get to the hype video for Drew and Lashley, which also fucked up because there was hot mics from the panel <laughs> at the beginning. Of it. <laughs> so, they're just really struggling here. But you know what, man? I appreciate it. Very, very I, it, AEW-esque here tonight. <laughs> yeah, quite. quite <laughs> a, did, did you see Tony Khan tweeting during this saying that how he would have handled this? <laughs> you need some help. <laughs> what? He said, he oh, well, we had bad weather. I just put rugs out. <laughs> <laughs> and Vince said, damn, that's true. <laughs> Shut up, bitch. <laughs> Worry about That's your shitty episode of Dynamite that you had, fucker. Hey, he would open the forbidden door, all right? That's how he yeah. the weather. Forbidden this. What I did was I just put the Bullet Club back out there again. <laughs> no, you, do, you know what they you do? You go, WrestleMania will start in nine days. Nine, nine days. days. WrestleMania will start. Nine days. <laughs> You're not the booker on the booker. Nine days. <laughs> There's a storm. <laughs> it's snowing. <laughs> it's it's snowing. <laughs> <It's staying. laughs> um, so the fans are following back into the building, and then of course, what better way than uh, to excite the crowd than to <laughs> oh, set up fuck. Titus O'Neil and Hulk Hogan? <laughs> this is uh Titus hometown, so they they're happy for him, and the second Hogan grabs the mic, everyone boosts. <laughs> they were booing him on the way out, pushed. apparently. Yeah. They immediately pushed the button. Let's can in these cheers. Yeah, we love They Hogan. did it hard on the second night canning the cheers for Hogan. <sighs> it still Hogan, couldn't stop it. It's It was like no. the episode of SpongeBob where Squidward takes him out the curtain and he just shows his arm and then shows his leg and then shows his body. And they're like, <laughs> yeah. yeah, boo, yeah, boo. 
Hogan keeps calling him Brother T, which just <laughs> didn't feel right to me. <laughs> he never called him Titus once. I don't think he knows Two his nights. name. <laughs> Two nights. He never he said Titus. He no idea who this guy. <laughs> Let me tell you something, dude. <laughs> Jack <laughs> Brother. <Yeah. laughs> WrestleMania, I think. Then they showed the Flying Dutchman boat in night two. Did they? They did. <laughs> yeah, they did. Spooky. I don't even remember yeah. that. Oh my god, <laughs> real spooky. Ooh, wait, wait, awesome. wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Was that after god. the fiend? That's, yeah. that's, what he left. that's what him and Alexa left on. <laughs> <laughs> they actually just walked back into the box like shark. <laughs> god, don't jump ahead. I can't Sorry. wait to talk about that. Okay, good. Go um, all right, so we open the show <laughs> with the WWE Championship Drew McIntyre against Bobby Lashley. And Bobby Lashley has lightning during his entrance, and they had to evacuate. <laughs> <laughs> Right at the venue, you had a fucking heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> the guy on the flag trying to fix the, the flag. He's still up there. He got electrocuted again. <laughs> he has to fight this skeleton at the top of the arena to get back down. <laughs> <laughs> um, Drew uh, is the first one out, though. He uh, does the countdown to put the sword on the stage, and he puts the sword on the stage. It fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> every time. Every, it, it, it always does. Every time. Yeah. It can't be. It has to be his fault at this point. <laughs> it's every time. <laughs> Come on. I Drew. hate the countdown, by the way. I, I, I mean, because I it was it. crowd, I didn't mind it. Because it was let the crowd chant something along for the first time and we're yeah. all fucking here with them. I was okay with that. But Give usually a visual I don't like body it. thing. Pull your shoulders up and then push them back down. It's really simple. I hated yeah. it when Team 3D did it too, where they'd be like, three, two, one, Divine, get the tables. Uh, no, just yeah, I shout didn't like it. That. I didn't just like shout that. it. <laughs> just get he should have wrote WCW in the air with a sword. <laughs> That's what he should have done. Dude, he did it for his finish. You yeah. know, three, I'll, two, one again. Yeah. Stop. It's like uh, tuning up the band, brother. <laughs> yeah, big countdown for you guys. That sucks. <laughs> Eventually, they started counting down when Shawn Michaels would hit the tuning up the band, too. I was like, what are you doing? What are you counting for? Yeah, he's just shouting out loud. <laughs> Three, two, one. That's a move, dude. Get the fuck out of here, man. Uh, this match was, I think, the longest match on the show on night one, I think. Um, yeah. But it was still, it yeah, was still it was, cool. It, I mean, it didn't was. feel too long. Oh, good. No, it wasn't bad. Um, they had Bobby kick out of three Future Shock DDTs. Which I thought was kind of cool because Drew beats fucking everyone. Yeah, he had three in a row too. That was dope. Yeah. Um, they there's a this is awesome chant at one point, and they cut to show the people chanting it, and none of them have masks on, which is pretty. <laughs> weird. Take I don't know, real weird about the. Ugh. I don't think there's a mask mandate there, so but I don't know how that works with this show. Like I don't. Somebody know they, told me that they did have a mask mandate, but you don't have to follow it. I said, well, that's not really. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a mass movie. We, That's not we how have, it works. We have a law that yeah, you don't worry about. <laughs> that doesn't mean what I think it means. Uh. Uh, Drew goes for a flying nothing at one point. Gets put in the hurt lock, which I actually I've grown to really like that name. <laughs> yeah, me too. Hurt at lock, first yeah. it sounded a little awkward. Nah, I'm into it. Yeah. Uh, Jimmy Lloyd was probably losing it. For Huge his teammate. hurt business guy. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Lashley goes for a main event spine buster. Gets rolled into a Kimura, which they sold pretty well. Uh, Drew goes for the Claymore. MVP says, blah, 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 and distracts him. <laughs> Drew gets he said, off. What is that? Dude, I swear to God, he said, Bobby. And Drew, and Drew goes, huh? <laughs> That's not your name. You're not Bobby. It was real weird. He just stopped like, huh? He literally yeah. was, huh? And then he kept going. <laughs> what do you say? Oops. Are you talking to me? Do you say Bobby or Drew? Yeah, Bobby okay. or Drew. So because Drew is an idiot, uh, Lashley puts him in the hurt lock and wins. Which yeah, just straight up. I was ecstatic about. I was like, wow. I was like, I was for sure that they were going to give it back to Drew so Drew could have his win in front of a crowd. Yeah, but they that, did not. We, we talked about that a while ago. Yeah. That he was just getting his WrestleMania moment out in front of the crowd, but Which he, is didn't, cool. he didn't submit. He passed out. I thought yeah, the same thing for Asuka, too, later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah uh, so Bobby retains the title. I thought that was cool. Yeah, I thought it was yeah, a pretty was good, good first match. It was. I mean, it was a good, like, they... Sometimes it felt like they were kind of just like being nice to each other, but some of that yeah. was pretty hard hitting. I thought that was pretty cool. So I was down yeah. with this one. I thought it was good. Good, good was first match because. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what else you would open with. I mean, a I big can't title match to start. They broke these dudes up there, the Hurt Business. I thought that I was yeah. like, I was a little confused because I didn't see the breakup. I was confused mm -hmm. why MVP was out there. I'm like, oh, if they broke him up, why is he still here? But apparently they just I, split it in two. Yeah, MVP says that like they're still recruiting for the Hurt Business, and then I guess Shelton and Cedric are, are still a thing too. Like that's weird. I thought that Shelton Wolfpack. and Cedric were good, and yeah, yeah. <laughs> her business black and red squirt business. <laughs> <laughs> so then we move on to the women's uh, tag team turmoil matchup with oh, a lot of women. Goodness, man, this on the show. Oh, there's the uh, the uh, NWO's backstage thing too. 
if you want to talk about that too. I didn't honestly, I didn't even write that down. What what was that? NWO is backstage with uh, Titus, and then Bailey comes in and says, Ding dong! And she tries to too sweet Kevin Ash, and then Kevin Ash no sells it. And then, what a mark. And mark, then Bailey yeah, goes, that's what he then, says. Ke- then Bailey walks off and goes, Call me, brother, call me. And then that was it. They that was do Bailey. A, a bunch of these Bailey segments over mm-hmm. the course of these two nights, and the payoff is everyone booing when Bailey gets shit on. <laughs> yeah. Well, Bailey the was fuck? the champion during the most of the early COVID stuff. So, like, Bailey they, was on every show yeah, at one point. They couldn't even find her on her way on the card. No. Oh, well. I mean, you had this NWO back there and you didn't even get Scott Hall to do the finger thing. Like, ooh. Yeah, so, really. Like, or throw the that. toothpick in Bailey's eye <laughs> and kill her. <laughs> <laughs> or just put Bailey in the turmoil. <laughs> yeah. She couldn't have a partner. Yeah. Yeah. Apparently, yeah. apparently, she pitched like this whole match and stuff and they said, nah, we're good. Yeah, mm-hmm. sounds about right. Um, so yeah, it is uh, Naomi and Lana uh, taking on Billy Kay and Carmella to start. Uh, this whole match is a disaster. Uh, yeah, that's really it feels just, real off. It feels real yeah. off. I, I don't feel know. Like, yeah, they were, they were never on. Like even from the beginning, it was just like someone missed a step, and then they just never. Yeah, got I, I, it, they just never. Yeah, they just never got it. Uh, Billy Kay uh, pins Naomi to eliminate Naomi and Lana, which. Also a decision. Pin to make. Naomi. Yeah, like couldn't have couldn't have been Lana. What? <laughs> like, couldn't have been Lana. Like <laughs> unbelievable. Yeah, there was a lot of pins. Uh, there was another pin in here that I was just like, what the fuck? Yeah. Uh. Yeah. There was a. I, I don't understand. He pinned Billy K. Yeah. That's what it was. I said, what are you doing? She's like, I, yeah. I thought Billy K was gonna win. I'm like, she's like the most yeah, interesting. Like you're gonna have piece her of this pin Naomi. Thing. Yeah. Just like Naomi. Wow. Shouldn't even been near this match, but whatever. Uh. Then Ruby and Liv come out next. Uh. Ruby. Pins Billy to eliminate that team, and then Carmelo super kicks Liv for for fun. Uh, <laughs> Mandy Rose and Dana Brooke come out next, and <laughs> Mandy Rose <laughs> slips. <laughs> does, oh no! She does a WrestleMania ode to Ultimo Dragon on the stage, <laughs> 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 and just eats shit on the stage. Mm. Uh, uh, Liv eventually pins Dana Brooke, uh, and the announcers the the ring announcer says that the Ride Squad was eliminated after <laughs> Liv pinned Dana Brooke. <laughs> been a lot of been a lot of moments. <laughs> On commentary. Uh, Natalia and Tamina are out next. Uh, and Tamina hits the Superfly splash to get the win to set up all of this to set up Tamina and Natalia against Nia Jax and Shayna Baszler. I don't know, man. What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> I don't know, man. Knowing what we know now, why did they have to win this? If You, you couldn't have just had like, the Riot Squad yeah, lose? Could have had anybody do it. Yeah. Or something? No, like, no actual tag teams here can win. No. If That's... you have if you have a team name, fuck off. Just go away. <laughs> Just... <laughs> there was only one team with a team name in this and, fucker thing. And y'all supposedly, got fucking beat. <laughs> supposedly go Mandy away. and Dana are a sexy muscle friends. I think that's their name. But... Yeah, and they lost it. <laughs> <laughs> <Got> it. <laughs> What a sweet name. I want that to be us. Can we name the podcast that? Yeah, I'll change it real quick. <laughs> if that's the title. <laughs> real quick. Sexy the muscle, the friend. Uh, then there's a 24-7 uh, title promo video. Uh, this is the best one they did. I don't even... What was on it? Like... I don't even remember. Rick Boogs uh, and Old Joseph Spice Average. and a bunch of other Yeah, stuff. yeah. yeah. And it's, well, it was the best one they did, and they didn't actually finish it. They're like, go to YouTube to uh, yeah, watch what? the rest of it. I said, no, this is the best one you did. There's yeah, a it was night like, two of Mania. <laughs> Just put it on They there. didn't have enough time. There's only, what, <laughs> 10 hours between these two shows and two nights? They didn't have enough time to show you that. You think they cut it because of the lightning? <laughs> no, they didn't cut anything. <laughs> I know for a fact they didn't cut nothing. <laughs> yeah. Then we move on to Seth Rollins taking on Cesaro. I was already looking forward to this. This has yeah. been fun. Uh, Seth has, uh, as of late, lost his mind, <laughs> which yeah. is pr- oh, pretty yeah. sweet. Wearing suits that look ridiculous. I have become Joker. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Joker, baby. <laughs> That's what, uh, wasn't Liv Morgan <laughs> in the match, or one of them was Ruby Riot? Was yeah, the yeah. Joker. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. I'm the Joker, I'm baby. The Joker, baby. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, does Seth, I think Seth has new music here? Yes, he does. It's like which, a mix. Yeah. yeah, which I, didn't, I thought it was cool. It was they got to take out all the burn it downs, but I, I think did. there was too many burn it downs. Yeah, it, it's awkward, but it was head banging enough for me. He got a yeah. lot of pyro too. Hell yeah, dude. And most pyro. of it was like off. <laughs> yeah. He was supposed to come down with all these like oh, fire yeah, yeah, yeah. sticks, and most of them just weren't on. <laughs> oh, well, well, the guy was up there trying to fix it. He got a new <laughs> He's still light. up there fighting the skeleton. They should have shown us an update. <laughs> that should have been a 24 7 title. Just thing. kept looking up there. 
<laughs> they should have hung the 24 7 title from the top of the ship you and said all right there. whoever gets it <laughs> it's like the war zone map you have to find out the code and then you have to go put it yeah. in the door and then and then it glitches yeah it glitches and you don't no one gets the belt <laughs> <Our truth retains. laughs> uh this was a really fun match I, I like this match a lot uh cesaro goes for the swing early the, the whole the story of this match is seth does not want to get swanged again he got yeah, swanged yeah. so is it because the counting on this performance is off wrestling fans do not know how to count revolutions they have no, no idea the concept ne- of never a revolution have. No, not even but once they say it was 22 i don't think it was 22 it's like on oh, this it was 23 show, well that's well i'm saying originally oh originally yeah, it was yeah. 22 yeah on this 23 also not 23 like, <laughs> they, they, they just start counting one two Three, yeah, they just four. count. It's like not even close. Yeah, yeah. have a damn revolution. He's damn it. spinning. One, yeah. two, three. He grabs his leg. Forty-seven. What I, don't the know, I thought we just got. Uh, but yeah, the whole story is Seth does not want to get uh, swinged. What the fuck Shwangy is the swung. plural for this? Is it swung? He's <laughs> getting swing. So he want to be. He want to be a swinger. Swinger. <laughs> uh, Cesaro goes. This is pretty sweet. Cesaro goes for like a second rope gut wrench. And Seth reverses it uh, into a buckle bomb, which was cool. Yeah, I don't remember sweet. when they. I don't remember when they brought the buckle bomb back. Probably when they decided fuck Sting. <laughs> <laughs> when Sting showed up in the AEW, they're like, "All right, we're doing the buckle bomb." Yeah, he's yeah. cool. It's all good. Uh, Cesaro did a crazy like stomp reversal uh, into the swing at one point. Seth hit the sling blade, and then he goes up top and hits this like I don't even know, like a three sixty frog splash. Oh like, yeah, even... that was uh, Treehouse Lee does that. That's right. He does yeah. it with an elbow, though. He does the Macho Man All-Stars finish. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> yeah, I like that a lot. Yeah, I did, too. It was sweet. Uh, Cesaro kills Seth with a fucking neutralizer, only for a two-count. Goes for <laughs> it again. Seth is trolling, dude. Dude, Seth is... <laughs> 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 Seth is out of his fucking mind, He had the man. biggest fucking smile on his face before he did Loki's low kick thing. Oh, oh my, my God. God. <laughs> I laughing so hard, dude. The biggest He's... smile on his face. Yeah, little shitter. Uh... Cesaro goes for the neutralizer again. Seth reverses it into a pedigree. Also, very cool looking for a two. Fuck you, Triple H. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this movie never finished nobody. Yeah. Uh, that's, uh, after that, Seth went for the stop, and then Cesaro ducked, and Seth did Loki's finish here. <laughs> <laughs> Biggest My smile. Finish. He's trolling, but he's laughing yeah. all the time. It's good stuff. Seth goes for the stomp. Cesaro does the pop up thing, not as uh, not as clean as the RKO one, but he did no, it good. Outside, still pretty good. Which though, is still, I like the kind of gritty. God, the RKO looking. one was so good. How fucking crazy! Like, I don't even know, like the amount of neck strength you got to have for that is probably disgusting, right? Yeah, like, I think so. You yeah, have to. my neck sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Neck's really good. I'm, I'm working. <laughs> I'm tired. My neck's good. <laughs> <laughs> but Cesaro <laughs> then busts out the UFO, which fuck. holy, this looks so good. That was dude. so sweet. What yeah. a crazy fucking move! I didn't even remember. Supposedly he did it last year at Mania, but I think he was on the pre-show. So it dude, Cesaro's been here for ten years. They say he's been here for ten years. I was like, what the fuck? Is that right? Yeah, he has ten yeah. years. That and I felt old instantly. I was like, wow, dude, I've stuff. been watching him since like two thousand and five. Yeah, this is That's scuffed. That's really the... he had shitty long hair when I first saw him wrestle. <laughs> <laughs> really it was horrible. Chad Cesaro. It was Chad horrible. Horrible. <laughs> he came out with a suit that had dollar signs on it. <laughs> <laughs> because he's making money, baby. Yeah, of course. Uh so yeah, he does the swing again. Of course, wrestling fans don't know how to count revolutions. Twenty three. Was... This was twenty three. Hey, I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, you counted it, Tony? Call it whatever you want. It's twenty three. <laughs> <laughs> And then he gets a neutralizer for the win, which also I didn't. I thought Seth was going over here, but Cesaro gets a big fucking win, and the crowd is losing it for him. First awesome. Mania win ever. No, first, first singles win because oh, he won yeah, the Battle Royale. Remember? But yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is his first singles win. The one in many of his single streak that has begun. Now he's going to take over wow. the Undertaker streak. It's going to happen. <laughs> Put it on an NFT. Yeah, Cesaro <laughs> NFT, and then and then put him on NXT. Cesaro on Steel Loki's move NFT. <laughs> uh, oh, speaking of the Andre, uh, Jey Uso won that on SmackDown. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I was so confused. He was like standing next to the trophy. I like peeked over. I said, "Wait, well, hold on. What happened here?" <laughs> no, the, see, you guys are forgetting. It wasn't SmackDown. It was WrestleMania SmackDown. Oh, oh yes. 
True. Which is similar to the pay per view in May, WrestleMania Backlash. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? I don't know, man. It's scuffed shit. I don't Do know. They, re- on. Scuff. they really think that wrestling fans, I mean, I guess maybe they are. They don't count revolutions, but they just think you're fucking stupid, huh? You have to explain <laughs> what Backlash means, the pay per view after WrestleMania? WrestleMania? God damn it. Backlash. Yeah, for all those Peacock people who had no shit what wrestling is. Oh, Season WrestleMania six, Backlash. Episode five, mm-hmm. WrestleMania Backlash. <laughs> Dude, all right, I'm going to complain a little bit here. So I paid for. Uh, Peacock Premium, uh, and Same. I was I was watching it a uh, bef- uh, couple days before. I was watching some Rumbles. I was watching. I watched ECW uh, Anarchy Rules '99, which does Taz's last match there, and it crowd shit on him. It was fun. <laughs> and everything I watched, except uh, WrestleMania, didn't have this problem. Everything I watched had ads. I swore I was paying for the ad-free version. I guess I am not. Is there a higher tier that yeah, I get how much super not ads? How much you paying? I th- well, I got the deal ski that they gave. Yeah, that's only for the ad ski. That's an ad ski deal. So there's a tier above what I'm currently paying. Yeah, there's a you pay for it and then you get ads. And How then much you pay is for that? With no ads, I don't ten. know, like ten bucks. That's ten. Okay, that's so. But the pay per view didn't have it, so I was okay with that. But I was like, I sw- or maybe maybe I am paying for the ten dollar one. I w- I feel like I went into it and it said premium. Is there a super premium? Is premium not good yeah, enough? Th- they're going to have you know the about new that? tier, Mega Premium, where you can actually go backwards on videos and stuff. Oh, wow. And pause. Yeah, it's, it's, the, NF, it's the NFT <laughs> Platinum version. You know how platinum, that one? Oh, Peacock Platinum with the, <laughs> yeah. with the pause button? <laughs> pause it. Uh, turn the audio Go down. back to the beginning of the show? That's fucked. You can find it when you search and stuff. It's really great. $50. Have you actually looked through like the Peacock? Interface. I typed in WCW, saw nothing, and canceled in disgust. <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah, that's really true. It, the interface is just weird. Like, it's awful, man. It's the it worst is. streaming service I use. Like I use a lot of streaming yeah, services. It's really bad. Like for shoot, worst. I know I'm not kidding. Yeah, it's it's just it's clunky. It's just not awkward. good. There's no there's no timestamps yeah. like. I don't know. Maybe they'll fix it. I don't Probably even know not. if you can look by matches. I don't think you can just look up like Rey Mysterio no, versus Brock Lesnar. No, uh, if you want to find Daniel Bryan, you can search Brian Danielson because that's what he's listed under. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> I think, really? I think because of maybe because of Total Bellas or something. Oh, my oh goodness. probably. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. He's <laughs> so like, if you look at the WrestleMania thing, it says Edge, Roman Reigns, and Brian Danielson. <laughs> <laughs> what a mark. <laughs> uh, but yes, uh, they recap the WrestleMania SmackDown as Tony said. Jey Uso won the Andre. Uh, and Rude and Ziggler retained the SmackDown tag titles because they're the Dirty Dogs. Yeah, what was up with that? They had Ryan dirty Nimeth dogs. on the show? Dirty Dogs. what? They had Ryan Nimeth and Bobby Rude as a tag team? <laughs> yeah, it's really <laughs> weird. Ryan Nimeth and Triple H are the tag champs? I thought Ryan <laughs> Nimeth was, was with J.D. Drake, but now he's with Bobby Triple Rude. H. Yeah, yeah what weird. the hell is this? And then they have Rude and Ziggler cut a promo? Uh, I don't know why. <laughs> <There's>, <laughs> they're not the on this show. Dirty dogs. <laughs> dirty dogs. Dirty dogs. All right. I didn't even know you were a tag chance, but keep it up. I didn't even know you had a name. <laughs> <laughs> the dirty Just dogs. the dirty heels, but not. I thought they were going to give Dominic and, and Ray the tag titles, honestly. Oh, that would be so cool. Yeah, that would be I don't good. know why they didn't. Yeah. We got to get the dirty dogs. Maybe they're going to do that when the game comes out or something. Yeah. Oh, I... you think Dominic's going to be in the video game? Maybe if Ray is on, if Ray's like the main guy, they, there's no way he didn't be like, all right, put Dominic. In he can't wait to play it, and also can't wait to beat his kids. <laughs> that will Dominic always be there. I'm glad the that game. he doesn't know how to delete tweets. Yeah, I, I just, in my mind, he just doesn't know that it's a problem. He just thinks people, <laughs> people like the tweet. They really like really 2013. Like, yeah, best game they ever made. Uh, so then we get uh, Big E once again back doing the New Day intro, which felt, which felt right. Felt oh, right. Uh, introducing Xavier and Kofi to the ring for the tag title raw tag title match against AJ Styles and Omos, who uh, no gear, full Omos gear. <laughs> Love this fucking guy. <laughs> <laughs> AJ comes out and almost slips on the stage. <laughs> it's pretty <Ooh>. awesome. <laughs> yeah. I uh, this match. What I so I, I'll say first. I I like this match. Um, mm-hmm. but I feel like I maybe just because I've been watching wrestling for so long, the psychology felt backwards because they like. The build was for the hot tag for the heel team, which didn't feel right. Yeah, but I feel Omos like they, is so over. Yeah, I feel like they actually just called it and said like, you know, yeah. this hot tag, like they're they're over for this team. Yeah, so like New Day had no problem just fucking and it worked, cheesing it up. Yeah, and yeah it was it, the best it, case scenario because if they would have done it the other way, it wouldn't have made any sense. It <laughs> it got just that, cheering for him. <laughs> it got that dude over huge too. Yeah, I mean that that's a. 
big fucker man. Yeah, really, yeah. He, he's fucking. All his moves are dope. It's just big ass, big dude moves. He did the claw. Iron claw. <laughs> Lock that sucker in. Uh, at one point, Xavier yells. Yes, he, he has AJ in a headlock in his corner. And he he looks at Michael Cole and he yells, "We are effectively cutting the ring in half." <laughs> 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 like awesome. after this. <laughs> uh, eventually uh, the hot tag comes Omos gets tagged in and he calls Xavier a bitch <laughs> <laughs> you little bitch yeah. they hits him with the Bane backbreaker <laughs> <laughs> backbreaker so I'm just throwing Kofi and him around he's running he's doing the, the run to the corner spot to elbow both of them while laughing <laughs> Maniacally, <laughs> he's having he's so much fun doing this. He's great. AJ hits the phenomenal forearm off of his shoulders, which is higher, oh, of course, than the top was, rope. That was awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that was cool. I, I was almost worried he was going to slip, but he did not. You think they got this dude doing shoulder rolls? And hell no, no, dude, no, no. Honestly, yes, I <laughs> would not surprise me if they did that <laughs> shit to this guy. Shoulder rolls and universals I and the guarantee Lord Tensai has him roll. <laughs> 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 No, he's oh, only training with Kali. He's learned how to do that big chop to the head. He's been, <laughs> no way. Adam Pierce is grinding him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's getting, the ropes. Yeah. Oh, drop down. He's, he's, getting, he's getting He's grinding. running around until he's throwing up. Oh, shit. Yeah. He's doing bag Never drills. Luck. <laughs> oh, Fuck. No. no. If he was doing bag drills, he would have quit. <laughs> Triple H comes in. Any hey, big man. person would have quit. <laughs> They're doing hey, man, big man in the middle. Your nuts is hanging out of your shorts. <laughs> yeah, man in the middle with Omos. <laughs> he's, he's just having a bump for everybody. It sucks. <laughs> uh, eventually, Omos hits a gigantic spine buster. He hit a, like a ten, like a you know the collie uh, kind of slam. The collie double choke slam, right? Yeah, yeah, like just crazy spine buster to Kofi for the win to win the tag team titles. Uh, this guy rules. I'm I so I God, this team rules. I'm so over yeah. the hill for this team, yeah. man. They're awesome. Little baby AJ Styles. What? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I I mean, I don't know who goes after him. Who can beat this dude? Like, you got to pin AJ to win, right? Like, yeah. it's Apollo no, Cruz and uh, the General Babatunde. <laughs> Babatunde. <laughs> General Babatunde. I love that fucker. All right. Uh, oh, and that that is when. Uh, Holy get, fuck, if they do that match, that would be so be good. Insane. Oh yeah, my god, insane. that would be so good. Wow, they that'd have to save great. that for like a big four pay like a SummerSlam or something. <laughs> the WrestleMania SummerSlam? <laughs> yeah. <right. Two>. <laughs> <laughs> uh then we get an ad for WWE 2K22. <clears throat> Let's all right. Let, all right. Yeah, they all announced right. it. Let's all save right. that. <laughs> Let's save that for we're gonna talk about that when we're done talking about WrestleMania. Okay, fine. Yeah, fine, we'll fine, come fine. back okay. to it. Stay tuned. Yeah. Uh, so after that, it is Shane McMahon against Braun Strowman in a steel cage match. Uh, cool. I guess I'm. I don't. The feud is Shane thinks Braun stupid. Braun disagrees. I want to give a shout out to all the stupid motherfuckers out there. <laughs> <laughs> all you fucking freaks out there, man. This all is you for idiots. Y'all. <laughs> like me. <laughs> you ever been stupid? You ever feel math? What? Science? What? <laughs> Social studies? My brain sucks. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, my brain sucks. <laughs> <laughs> what? Before the match, Elias uh, jumps Braun and he gets on the mic and says, Jeff Hardy, you drug addict. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about the real conspiracy out here. Jeff Hardy's <laughs> backstage snorting lines and drinking beers. Where is where is Jeff Hardy? I don't where know. Is he's he? looking for his old theme song. Trying to fix the flag? Is that what he's doing? <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's actually the one that's up there. They set him up there yet. <laughs> he's got like one Jeff glow stick there. so he can see the flag. He's trying to figure <laughs> he's, it out. <laughs> he's, he's drinking it. He's got lost. dripping it. <laughs> they should have gone. They should have done that. And gone what? backstage and looked for Jeff Hardy. <laughs> just for fun? And they find him. And he's just eating. He's the <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing you can do with that dude. Like Jeff Hardy isn't gonna pop anybody. I on Rus- WrestleMania want the Elias never ending <laughs> fucking feud with Jeff Hardy, man. So Elias jumps Braun before the match. Uh, eventually Shane rips off a. Shane just keeps finding random things to hit Braun with. Like he rips off a piece of the cage and hits him with it. <laughs> do they always put the little stand up there for people to stand on? Have they done? No. It? I think they. I, I think that's fairly new. But yes, they've been doing it for little baby cage match. Yeah. Uh, I think it's like that in the games too. But cage matches in the games are fucking not fun at all. So. They're yeah. horrible. I was talking about earlier too. Um. Like tag town's like, damn, I really want to make great Kali and RVD as a tag team now. <laughs> yeah. And I was like, 
Oh wait, I don't. I really don't like playing tag team. What are you gonna do? These games. Yeah. Right, yeah. I yeah. was, and I was like, I've never really thought about that. I'm like, I'm gonna make them in universe. I'm like, but why? I I always skip the tag matches, and it hit yeah. me. I'm like, oh my god, the tag matches are not fun. <laughs> unless you do like, unless you do like tornado tag, and even then, it's like a chore because like, uh, two like the AI will always have one person go outside to fight. Like it's. Oh, especially in 2K20, they always go outside. It's a count yeah. out like every other match. God damn it. I it's horrible. Amen <laughs> yeah. to that, brother. <laughs> uh, Shane hits the coast to coast on Braun, kind of. He'd like, the, sh- like, Braun's like kneeling and he mm-hmm. jumps and hits it. Oh, all right. Van Crush in Nader. No. <laughs> <laughs> Shane said, fuck Rob's Hall of Fame. I'm doing your move. I'm still doing your move, Thanks, fucker. Bitch. Yeah. <laughs> Just straight up stole it. He was doing it while like Rob comes in. <laughs> he's still doing it. <laughs> yeah, I love Rob talking about. It. He's like, did they ever? Did he ever ask you? No. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what are you gonna say to Shane McMahon? I mean, yeah, he's, he's like, well, he's didn't call it the Van Terminator. He's like, yeah, that's Van Shane <laughs> That'd be awesome. Uh, Elias and uh, Jackson Riker uh, climb up to try yeah, to my help. My gunner. How's this dude still here? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, they climb up the side of the cage to try to help Shane out of the cage, uh, but to, to no avail as Braun runs headfirst into the cage to knock him all down. Because <laughs> he's stupid <laughs> as hell. Eventually, uh, Shane McMahon pulls a toolbox out of his ass and hits Braun in the head with it. I have no What's idea what the fuck. bag up there for? Where the There's fuck a bag it? up what? in the top. The, what was that doing there? Is it always there? No, I, I don't know if no, that's there. It's, it's never there ever. They just put it there for this match. <laughs> What is going on with this? This is like an altered cage or something. And with a dual an altered cage, <laughs> this cage-like structure. <laughs> <laughs> you know the dual like bonk. He took yeah, he just, just, just like a flat back off. <laughs> bonk. Uh, Shane uh, it has the win. He he should have won. He's climbing down and he decides to stick his little baby hand through the cage and wave to Braun. Yeah, and Braun is boo boo, na 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 boo. I'm yeah, gonna... yeah, but, 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 but. He, he actually started yelling, Bobby! <laughs> distracted himself. <laughs> Drew said, What? <laughs> <laughs> Drew is backstage and catering. What? <laughs> it was actually impressive. Braun was definitely down when Shane started waving, and then immediately Braun was on his feet. I don't know, that's a quick motherfucker. But he yeah. grabs yeah. his hand. He's a train or something. <laughs> they didn't do it in this match. <laughs> I didn't get one. Yeah, I was surprised. I was like, "Cause you oh, can't can't drive a train in a cage." I guess <laughs> you could. You could try. <laughs> well, you got a toolbox. Yeah, yeah, I guess yeah you yeah, could. But, uh, but they should have a little, they should have a little, little uh, train track cart. at the top. Yeah, yeah. like a little baby, <laughs> <laughs> just circling. <laughs> The whole like, time. That sounds like something they would do, man. Yeah, like when they did, what was it? Was it Big Show and or was it Eddie and somebody? It was they did like the barbed wire at the top Big of Show, it? Big Show, Big Show and Eddie. Big Show and Eddie, yeah. They oh, was it JBL and Eddie. Did they yeah, do JBL yeah. and Eddie one too? Chapman went with, with a train track that just keeps going around. No, I think it was Big Show and uh, JBL. No, I remember. Okay. Yeah, yeah. One of those. Or it might have been, was it Eddie and JBL? It was, I don't know. Might have been Jamie those. Noble and Nitty. No, because, it? no, but it was Big Show because he, <laughs> <laughs> she was blind all the time. How'd you get in there? <laughs> Taking it out. Because <laughs> JBL went through the ring, remember, and then he won the match because he crawled through the ring after he went through it. In the Budokan, yeah, I remember yeah, that. Yeah, I, I remember that. I was there. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so, Braun grabs Shane's hand, uh, and... He can't drag him out, I guess, because, I don't know, he just he couldn't drag him back up. He's, Shane was, like, halfway down the cage. So, bro, this is pretty cool, I thought. Braun just rips the cage wall down. He just, was that dope. was cool, yeah, actually, was cool. Yeah. He just grabs the fucking wall and just... You know, they have to, like, double reinforce it now for every Braun cage match they ever yeah. have. And then uh, he, t- he drags Shane back into the ring. And then eventually they end up on top of the cage again. And this is what I wasn't sure what they were going to do here. Uh, Shane, continuing to prove that he, maybe he's stupid. <laughs> because he's the I think he has no brains. Yeah, maybe he is the dumb man because Braun launches this fucking dude off of the top of this cage, and Shane takes such a gnarly bump into the ring that, like, I was for sure he was fucked. He the canyon hits, flip bump. He hits yeah he so did. hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's exactly what he did. He hits so hard. The replay even grosser. I was like, oh. uh, yeah, so like, you know, most of Shane stuff since he came back is, you know, he's ju- jumps off whatever, jumps through the pads or whatever. Yeah. This dude took a goddamn flat back from the top of a cage. Yeah. I, and it wasn't even, he didn't even hit perfect center, dude. Oh my no, God. No, he hit like, uh. honestly. And then, dude, yeah. so not only he takes the bump off the top, 
And then Braun goes, we got one more spot. <laughs> yeah. that, that, that can't finish it. I got to hit my finisher. <laughs> oh, my finisher. <laughs> Dude, yeah, like you said, it wasn't center of the ring. It was near the corner, which is way it's like next to the apron. It's the hardest part of the ring. <laughs> Shit's fucked. Yeah, I've taken a face bump there and wanted to die. Yeah, so I, I can't I imagine my... taking a cage, of, a bump on the top of the cage and just yeah. like, fuck, man. I fell on my head in that spot of the ring. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> you good. probably felt like you got a concussion. It's it's yeah, like, I we joke one. about the hardest part of the ring thing, but it is. It's and it fucking sucks. Very hard. Yeah, like, <laughs> yeah, dude. Whenever trash. you see like people do like tack spots, I mean, obviously they put them in the corners because you don't want them in the center because you're mostly going to work in the center. But like landing on tacks in a corner of a ring is... Fucking horrible! <laughs> like, it's, I can't even worse. imagine. Yeah, that's probably why it goes imagine. in so good. If you do it too, um, yeah, because the ring is just yeah straight just up metal. Solid. It's just fucking, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just get all fucking pine there. So, so yeah, Shane dies, and then Braun says, "This is for anyone that's been called stupid." <laughs> and Randy Cross stands up. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, this only works in Florida. <laughs> Jimmy Lloyd, stupid or dumb Jimmy as Jimmy Lloyd fuck. stands up. <laughs> yeah. <Can't>. dumb. <laughs> Are you stupid? And I'm dumb as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's all for you stupid motherfuckers out there. Then GCW chance started. GCW, GCW, <laughs> and then Braun hits the running power slam for the win. This was, I mean, for what I expected, this was better than I expected. <laughs> oh, the finish was awesome, dude. Like yeah. him, like okay, he had to, you know, he had to climb down the cage a little bit and be a little stupid yeah. to get there. But I, yeah. I like this. I thought that was cool. It was uh, impressive. And that yeah. bump off the top, I'll remember forever. That's the dude. That was insane. Shit I've ever that seen. was crazy. He hit so fucking hard. I've seen dudes it. do cross bodies off of before, but like he took a raw ass just bump off the top of the cage, and I just don't yeah. even know what to say. <laughs> like that's I, like I don't even know it's what to brutal. say. I need yeah. a fucking NWA of that, whatever the fuck it's called. Just fuck. <laughs> <laughs> <And that's> NWA. <laughs> yeah, did you guys yeah, get your uh, DraftKings pool live predictions correct? I was match? going to. Did you actually I do did it? it? I did, did it, you? yes. Did you win, son? So, How did it work? So you just, uh, it's a free pool, so like everybody gets in and they split $25,000 between the winners, I guess, kind okay. of thing. But like you still win based off of how many you get right. So then like based. it comes down to like, I think I won two cents of the whole oh, thing. Oh, sick. Wait, you actually won? Uh, well, no, I got seven of eight, and then you get two cents because... Wait, you had to so, guess all the matches? Well, so, like, for this one, they had... Well, it was, like, a pool, so there's, like, eight different entries. So the first one is for this match, which was, who will win, Braun or Shane? Will Shane do the coast-to-coast, -coast, yes or no? Uh, will... Oh, it's just the questions. Yeah, oh, what will it, be the... It's for every match they had this? No, no. This one was... They did two different matches on this one, and the night two, they did two different matches. So then... Okay. Then they said, how will they win? Will it be a pinfall by Braun and or you got, Shane? you got or seven or... out of eight on this match? No. on There's only... Hold on. Just let me... Uh, so who will win, Braun or Shane? <laughs> you know what's Shane, will, will Shane do the coast-to-coast? -coast? How, how will they win? And then will there be outside interference? And those okay. were the ones for this match. So right. then I got all those right. Oh. And then the other one was the women's match. Who will win that? How will they win pinfall, DQ, or submission? Will there be over 5.5 pinfalls or more <laughs> or under 5.5 pinfalls? Wait, what? what is oh, a 5.5? Yeah. What is a point? So, like pinfall? pinning five times in the match, you know? Five like and a half pinfall. Times? Yeah. What's a half so, a pin? No, it's like you like think about going it's, for it. It's but over you... under. It's over under. So, you got to, will it be over five or below five? <laughs> I'm gonna go and then 5. Were, 3. And then the last one was will there be a <laughs> fuck off, I quit. <laughs> I'm done. You can go to hell. No, go on. No. Go on. That's it. No, I guess you're Listen, you just confused me. It's not my fault. I'm learning. It yeah, says I, over 5.5 under 5.5. 5. All right, I go 5.2. Yeah, yeah. No, that's much. not how it works. <laughs> a little too much, kid. Back up. I'm glad Braun won for you both, your dumb asses. So you won two stupid. cents because you're wrong and you're stupid. Yeah, you didn't win 25,000. Should have put 6.2 pinfall. You can't choose. It's two options, you this dumb for all you son of a motherfuckers bitch. out there, baby. Oh my gosh. You guys are the dumbest people I've ever seen. Oh, hell, hell. Your neck you sucks, you're a dumb son of a bitch. <laughs> Enjoy your two cents, you mark. <laughs> they got this. your information. Hope they send you newspapers. <laughs> hey, I'm going to win big on DraftKings. Right. <laughs> You're going to get Vogue magazine sitting in your house. Yeah. <laughs> Enjoy I got those some... emails, you idiot. I actually uh... have some 
penny CDs coming to my house. Cover <laughs> 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 uh, So yeah, that matches. That happened. Uh, so then there's a. I don't know why they did this. There's just like a mid-show gigantic pyro display. <laughs> <laughs> I think, I think they were going to announce some sort of attendance number. <laughs> and they said, fuck it. <laughs> Just having fun. Fuck it. The COVID attendance record <laughs> for most death waivers signed. The WWE. Amount. There the are biggest. now 25,000 people with COVID. The <laughs> amount of people. <laughs> with- <laughs> wow, the numbers have spiked. Then uh, they go back to the commentators. Uh, Bailey interrupts them and calls Michael Cole an idiot. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Right. Ding dong. Yeah. Ding dong, Bailey. It. Then they show the 2020 Hall of Fame uh, video for all the 2020s dun, dun, out there. Dun, dun, dun. I was really confused, man. I had no clue what was going on. <laughs> I'm like, 20, Why? 20, 20 what? Yeah. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. I thought Eric Bischoff was in this. And then it was like, oh, this is last year. <laughs> yeah. No, that was this year. Yeah. They did it. They did. They aired two of them this year. They did yeah, the 2021 know, they, one. They, they the did 2021 yeah. then. And right, I was like, yeah. what yeah, the it fuck was, is this? It was very weird. It was confusing. Speaking of. It, Fucking weird. Uh, they show the video, and then a bunch of bunnies start hopping in the ring. <laughs> what the That's fuck? Definitely an entrance. So a bunch of bunnies start hopping in the ring. Uh, one of them loses their head. A couple of them lose their ears. <laughs> they really yeah, did you the see hell? the one that lost his head? I could not believe it was CM Punk. That was fucking crazy. <laughs> it was Jeff Hardy. He was high. <laughs> <laughs> Elias is looking for him. He's another one of bunnies. <laughs> He's a bunny the whole time. <laughs> it was actually Justin Gabriel again. Fuck. <laughs> God damn it, Justin. Uh, yeah, so a bunch of bunnies come out. Really shitty attires. They didn't really... Uh, the, the budget must have been tight for the bunny outfits. Very tight. Uh, Miz and Morrison do a live performance of a song that uh, I didn't understand, but Whew, cool. yeah, this won't for me. But good job on that thing. Yeah, I mean, I I like it's, I've, they've done songs before. Like I like the music video stuff. I think it's funny. Mm-hmm. This uh, this was out of out. What was there like three or four live performances? This is probably like number three. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> Rhea, Rhea Ripley's Rhea Ripley's was four. <laughs> <laughs> that that was the- see. They were lip syncing, but also singing at the same time. So they had the actual song in the back, and then them singing on top that's of the what song. Wale, that's what I thought Wale was doing. But then it, I they don't think like, I don't. This, man. I don't know if his was even. Right. I don't know then if his he, mic was even on. He put his mic down, and he was still singing. <laughs> he was still singing. <laughs> that was awesome. He really likes the song. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so we get a long ass fucking promo video for this match. After that, as well, a lot of long. Promo they did videos. this all like. And a couple of matches too, where they sh- have an entrance, then they play the promo to the match, yeah. then they go to the ma- the other entrance. It's really weird. I don't know why they yeah. did that. You would think like they're setting up for a gimmick, but no, just, just get the bunnies out of here. <laughs> yeah, get all those bunnies out of there. <laughs> Fuck out of here, bunnies. Uh, sp- I didn't realize this. Supposedly, Bad Bunny. I I knew he moved to Orlando, but he's been he's been trained by Gulak and Adam Pierce, which is I oh guess, nice. Those are like two of the best. You, you can't train. really find. It's hard to find anyone like more qualified to train a motherfucker than. God, man, yeah, that's actually, like, insane to think about. Yeah, that's yeah. truly two of the best you can get. Uh, and, of course, much like Adam Pearson and Drew Gulak, uh, Bad Bunny comes in riding on the top of a trailer. <laughs> just like <laughs> the shield. <laughs> yeah, just like the shield, yeah. Dude, <laughs> Bad Bunny was awesome in this match. This was cool. Uh, he was really, really good. I mean, honestly, yeah. I... I didn't know what to expect. I expected, you know, I guess because of Dominic and the way that he kind of picked up on things, yeah. I was like... The performance center allows for guys to come in and you can kind of learn some stuff pretty quick. Mm-hmm. Right. Uh, and I kind of expected a, just a little bit, but he ex- he went by any expectations. He I figured was he was going to just be like, you know, that one little tag at the end, do a spot, and then that mm-hmm. would be his thing. But he was in there yeah. for like the majority of the Dude, match. he was getting heat. D- yeah. D- d- what the hell? He started the match. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he that started was crazy. The match. Yeah, he like, did. he wasn't the hot tag. He was, yeah, he was the star. He was the I, can't, I can't name yeah. one move that Damian Priest did that whole match. I don't think I, he did any. I, I can name one only because he did it with him. He did both did the Falcon Arrow. <laughs> Yeah, oh, okay. they, you're yeah, right. yeah, that's yeah. the one. Yeah, yeah he did really, yeah, yeah, this is really the bad anything. bunny match. <laughs> yeah. I mean, and he looked fucking cool. Once he, he did like a tilt a whirl head scissors, I was like, okay, that was awesome. That's all. And then he did more after that. I was like, what the fuck? Yeah, he kept going. Uh, early, he did like an arm drag and a Lamai Shaw cradle. I was like, that's cool. Dude, he, he did shit. a Lamai Shaw. I said, let's get yeah. it. <laughs> yeah, it, was, it looked good, too. Yeah, uh, that's awesome. Miz then shit canned him into the second row when he died. <laughs> <laughs> he sold it, too. Dude, he sold everything he did, which is like. Wow, that's Adam Pearce and Drew Gulak for you. Like you said, they got a lot 
of fucking heat on this dude. Uh, and they got him a bad to, bunny, bro. That's dude, crazy. Props to Miz and Morrison for that shit, man. Yeah, like, yeah, tried. yeah like, for sure. I they mean, didn't... bad bunny put the work in, but you gotta know what the fuck you're doing to to make you know a new guy first match WrestleMania look good like that. Like, yeah, they, did not, I was just they scared. didn't have they didn't have big heads at all about this. No, what are you saying, Tony? No, I was scared, like, because I was like, oh, he's gonna dive on the Miz. Oh shit, he's no. gonna die. Oh god, <laughs> don't dive on the I didn't Miz. Even think about it, that. I know, it I didn't out. either. It worked. Wow. It worked out though. It did work out when he did dive though. Damn, Thank imagine how legendary. Tope. Imagine yeah. how legendary no. that would have been. Oh my god, <laughs> I thought don't he was going for a tope at one point. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, uh, Bunny hits a tornado DDT. I, I wrote Bunny for all this. It feels I don't want to keep saying Bad Bunny. <laughs> this is not yeah, AEW yeah. Bunny. That's fine. <laughs> He's better. Uh, <laughs> 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 and uh, Bunny and Damian Priest both hit uh, <laughs> Stereo Falcon Arrows, which is AEW in the mud. Cool. Bad Bunny <laughs> number one. Yeah, lost the war. <laughs> 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 Damien Priest, the new butcher. <laughs> or the, the Falcon Arrow thing was sick though, because they both hit at the cool. exact same time. They did yeah. it like as best you could do. Uh, Priest is a big dive on Miz and Morrison, followed by a cross body from the top to the floor by Bad Bunny. And Miz rushes in, hits a skull crushing finale on Damien Priest. Bad Bunny makes the save <laughs> for the pin on Damien <laughs> Priest. At this point, I had no clue what was going on. Yeah, this was <laughs> real crazy. I'm like, wow, okay. Then shortly after that, on the outside, Bad Bunny hits a Canadian destroyer. Oh, oh my Morrison. god, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? I was, and then PD uh, Williams on Twitter said, my finisher. <laughs> <laughs> I hear that, PD. And then Scott Steiner on Twitter said, fuck you, PD. Yeah, fuck, <laughs> yeah, fuck, fuck you, PD. <laughs> and Drew said, huh? <laughs> Dude, destroyer on the floor. They kept, dude, they, they kept saying, bunny destroyer, bunny destroyer. Ugh. Booker really wanted to get bunny destroyer over. Oh, yeah. But I love that Booker was on this commentary this match. He made it great. Oh, Morrison did the spin rooney at one point. Yeah, he was mocking him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which, I saw a video later. I forgot about this. Uh, Doran Morrison's, like, Tough Enough uh, tryout. He, uh, they, like, I think it was, <laughs> it might have been Kevin Dunn that asked him if he can do this spin rooney <laughs> And he said. Yeah, and he does. Yeah. <laughs> he said. What's that? I don't know what that is. <laughs> he said, I don't know what that is. And it was like, oh, you don't know, you don't watch the product. You don't know Booker T. He's like, oh. And then he did like a crazy spin rooney They did. And then he did it at WrestleMania in front of Booker T, which I thought. Sorry, was cool. Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch. Hey, Kev. yeah. <laughs> Fuck you. Uh, eventually, uh, <laughs> Damian Priest and Bad Money do a crossbody doomsday device <laughs> for the win. <laughs> I just. Fuck, man. This was the best it could have been. I, I, yeah. I mean, yeah. Like, like this is what? like the peak that this match could have been. They really, like, Bad Bunny was incredible. Damian Priest didn't try to, like, you know, he had no qualms about letting Bunny just do his shit. Yeah. yeah. Morrison and Miz were just, they didn't big head this at all, so they were super down sure. for it. Miz definitely let Bunny just hit him in the face a few times, just, like, straight up slug him. Yeah, oh, like, sure. Some I of those mean, he you won't know. pull, and he was just slugging. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah. Miz was like, yeah, all right. Because he had this big, like, red mark on his face. I'm like, yeah, Bunny's yeah. just slugging him a few times on a couple of these. Uh, Dude, how cool. nervous does that? I mean, I, obviously he's a, you know, big fucking star, and I'm sure he's done concerts in front of plenty of people but that's what like i was a whole thinking when it came out whole different deal. like he he didn't feel like out of place either though which i thought was no cool. main event time which I, I there was a lot of uh arguments about this being the main event i don't know why i don't know what else you would have the main event on night one i mean it, it when it comes down like put bam non-factor arguments about the like build sure mm -hmm. whatever it's fine any argument you, you, you can have the royal rumble winner gets the main event that's yeah. for me. That's all. That's all. Unless you change the rules, yeah. that's what it is for me. So both nights, the Royal Rumble winners got the main event, which yep. does. I think that's what it should be. And I, I guess mean, the arguments were baseless. Drew yeah. requested to go on first too. I guess he wanted to. So did he? That's kind of cool. And then Vince yeah, said, "How about said. I go before you?" <laughs> <laughs> and then Drew said, "Huh? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Bye, <Bobby. laughs> We have Sasha Banks defending the SmackDown <laughs> Women's Championship against Bianca Belair. Uh, Michael Cole blatantly, like he, not blatantly, but like full out on commentary with his full chest says, "For the first time in the main event of the WrestleMania, two black women compete," uh, which was fucking. That was I was cool. like, "Wow, okay, like cool, kinda, good deal." Yeah, that kind of like put it like into yeah. super perspective. That was pretty sweet. Yeah, and you can tell this means fucking everything to these two. Uh, they're both like. Trying to hold Dude, back tears at the start. Like, even this before, is yeah, Bianca was like uh, tearing up right away. Yeah. She just knew how big a moment this was. But then they, they both snapped out of it and got into fucking 
work mode and this match. God bless Sasha Banks for how much she gave here because oh I feel like God. this was just like an entire Bianca Belair showcase match. Yeah. I mean, Sasha did some yeah, cool shit, but Bianca just, what a fucking star making performance for her here. The only thing that threw me off about this was Bianca was so fucking good in this match and showed how good she was and how she could hang with Sasha. Obviously, Sasha been calling her a rookie, but on commentary, mm -hmm. she's like calling her like an underdog. Doesn't Bianca like win all the time and like won the rumble and like <laughs> like how is she an underdog? Why not just put her over as this? she's like killing Sasha? She's jacked. Put her over as the fucking like next big thing. Like like well, that they, country singer. Yeah, <laughs> they have her tomorrow. You can't do that. Yeah. Like, <laughs> that was the only thing I didn't like. I was like, God. They always she, do that. It's like every match. There's like the they. That's like the one the story underdog. it kind of defaults yeah. to is the underdog yeah. thing. Yeah. God damn. Um. um this was incredible. Yeah. This was easily Dude, my favorite great. match both nights. Uh, probably one of my yeah. favorite Mania main events ever of all time, and I'm not even kidding. It's so good. It was, uh, they couldn't have done any better than they did. This was the perfect match. Everything about it went perfect. Uh, the ending was genius. They fucking, she sauced that whip. She hadn't done that. Oh, I feel like I haven't seen that whip dude. in months. And, dude, uh, what the wow, fuck? Incredible. That thing was nasty. They both delivered. How do you watch this match and not think, yeah, that should have been the main event? How do you how do you not think that? Yeah, that I think awesome. anybody that ever said that before, you have no base at Hopefully all. Hopefully, you're okay yeah. with admitting you're wrong. It's and okay. you are not I, based. <laughs> <laughs> that is that is a thing in wrestling that I feel like a lot of people uh, are are weird about. That I think mm -hmm. they want to get gotcha moments. Uh, it it is very okay to change your opinion at any time. You yep. can change it tomorrow. You can change it ten minutes after you said something that. Well, you now don't agree right. with it. It is very yep. okay. Time and, changes. And a lot of that's, I mean, that's a big Twitter thing, I think. Like, uh, oh, what? Well, you, you, you didn't like him? Like, sometimes yeah. I get tweets about Braun. Oh, was Braun your favorite? Yeah. That was three yeah. years ago. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> dude. I think it's, it's especially changed, like, dude. It's, it's especially like sort of magnified when, you yes. know, we create videos and stuff and there's like, oh, God. They can go it back just and lasts watch forever. it. And yeah, yeah, it's just there. Yeah. But yeah, I, I, see that all the time too it is very okay you get our permission to change your opinion forever change it everything about it anything whenever it's okay i yeah. think wrestling will be a lot better when people accept that it's okay to like something today and not like it tomorrow and vice versa but otherwise oh anyway but if you if you didn't like this you're wrong sorry <laughs> <laughs> if you didn't like this go ahead and change come on you got time yeah come on i mean we're listen that was an open window that was a long rant to get you to admit <laughs> That we're waiting. Rolled, and it <laughs> this been match is awesome, though. They did. Dude. Uh, they, Sasha Banks huh. like grabbed her hair at one point, put like the bank statement with her hair wrapped up. That was and, like, the whole clever thing. That was like fuck. crazy, and she could yeah. like knock it to the ropes. That was really sick. This Listen, match was perfect, dude. At one point, this is this is one of the most impressive things I've seen in wrestling in general. Bianca is on the outside. Sasha dives, does a suicide dive on her. Bianca catches her, presses her into the air, walks up the stairs. And then throws her into the ring. What the fuck, dude? That was, was that? crazy. That there was some real like fun. Steiner s moments here. Yeah, they dude, all yeah. felt really good. Sasha was grabbing Bianca by the hair and hit her with a bunch of knees. She goes for the double knees in the corner, and Bianca just dumps her. Bianca does Tully's finisher twice and then dude, squats. I, dude, I was <laughs> pop huge, pop huge. The double Tully. That's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Uh, I thought she was going to go all four at first. I was like, I thought so too. I wish she did, honestly. She was going to go three, pin her, and then do it on the fourth one. Rip Flair! Yeah, bye Bianca hit a standing shooting star press, and then after it hit a, she went for a top rope 450, and Sasha got the knees up, which was a rough landing. It was so rough, yeah. Yeah. Sasha goes for a Rana, gets caught with two fucking power bombs. Uh, she go, stuffed she, the fuck out dude, of her on that those. second one oh was my, rough. Those are mania bombs, man. Yeah, that was good. Uh, at one point, Banks is on the outside uh, and goes up the mega call and says, "What time is it?" And he says, uh, it's, "It's balls time." Balls time. <laughs> <laughs> uh, like Tony said, Sasha used the used Bianca's hair to get into the bank statement, which was just really fucking wrapped cool. it uh, like the sequence to get into it where she wrapped it around her. Yeah. Oh my god, this. Match was so good. <laughs> it was so good. It was so good. Uh, Bianca hit a four. Bianca's four fifty. I think we talked about this before. It doesn't did, make yeah. sense. It. I don't understand how. It's like slow motion, but it never looks like. In the end, it doesn't look like she's gonna like fuck no, it up. 
It looks really good too. I don't know if it's the hair like going along it's with it. It's the most it. awkward forfeit that I've ever seen. But then when she gets that rotation around, it's like wow. Yeah, yeah. it's like, crazy. Fuck. Bianca goes for the uh, psycho driver. Sasha gets out of it. Then it, this is where uh, Sasha is holding her hair, lets it go. Bianca just with all of her might whips the fucking dog shit out of Sasha's stomach, leaves a gigantic fucking mark on her. <laughs> I don't even know how you even. I don't know. I don't know hair physics. I don't know how you do that. <laughs> she had a giant ass welt on her. Did you see that Dude, after yes, the match? It was gross. insane. Gross. I love it. She hasn't used it. I don't know if she's used it since she was on the main. Or if she did, she was like right when she showed up because she hadn't used yeah. it for months. So, like, it was so loud. The entire match, they spent the time showing that her hair, hair. Is, a, yeah. is a negative factor to yeah. her. But then in the end, she uses it as a positive. It, this yeah. was yeah. too good of a match. Hits her with the hair, honestly, then hits the whoever, psycho driver, gets the win. It's so fucking good. I yeah. mean, the only, I guess, the that Bailey sasha match, I'm sure everyone talks about, is that match was fucking awesome, too. That but, was great, oh, yeah, yeah. but it won't this one. In it won't the main this, event of Mania. Yeah, I mean, it yeah. Yeah, 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 it, yeah big, this was yeah, way different. This was really fucking All good. the stars so, yeah. aligned here. Bianca gets the win, gets her big moment, wins the title in the main event of WrestleMania. Fucking awesome, man. This was... Cool. Uh, Michael Cole blew the call though, <laughs> and <then laughs> he said that Sasha kicked out. <laughs> we'll, we'll never hear that ever again. <laughs> hey, fucking, yeah, well, that's edited already. I'm sure. <laughs> we'll never hear that God. ever again. That like the fucking oh, he must have felt like such an asshole. <laughs> I didn't even hear it. I like I was freaking out, so she I didn't even out. hear it. Yeah. yeah, and then someone posted it. I'm like, did he really say that? And yeah. I was like, oh, I guess so. Rough. Yeah, I didn't hear yeah. it because I was just like, well, this is incredible. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. It was cool though. Uh, not that that wasn't cool, but the match. That was, was easily cool. the match of both nights for me. That was it. So this was definitely. I love this match. Uh, I think, in in wrestling terms, I think this is my favorite match. Yeah. But the night two main event is such a fuck fest of just bullshit and running. Yeah. I just, like <laughs> that's like my kind of wrestling. So like it's tough for me, but it's close. 